Hi guys, it's Tara Reed. You're watching Joe and Marie all day, all night. YouTube family. Uh, this could be a light video. I got two packages from whatnot, so we're just gonna dive right in. I'll show you everything that I got. Uh, first package has some bubbles in it. And this is gonna be a wicked short video. Yep. Won't even take all day or all night. Yep. And I miss saying that. A uh, couple of packages. You just fumbled the box. But I got five titles, a couple out of print things. But this is a upgrade for the collection that I wanted to pick up. I have the uh, case and a half wide one, but I wanted it on Blu ray, and this is Pearl Harbor. I enjoy this movie, it's really good. So good, yep. So I had to pick that one up for the collection. History this one is was out of print, then they came out with uh, an MOD, if I'm correct. Mm -hmm. And this guy, when he opened it up and showed it, if I remember now, the guy's name was Clutter Fines on there. I'll leave you in the description down below his info. But when he opened it, he showed to make sure that the disc wasn't scratched. And I realized that this is the press disc. This is the actual out of print one. So I had to pick this one up because I'd rather have the out of print, the original out of print press disc than the MOD. I haven't seen it. And it is <laughs> Apocalyptico. So I have it on DVD in the collection. I want to upgrade it to Blu ray. And, and there I, you go. I wanted it to be the non press disc. It's similar to the Cable Guy. That when the Cable Guy got re-released, it was an MOD. Wow, it's I have the original press disc of it, so I was really, really happy with that. Hi, kids. This one I'm gonna have to replace the case because the the case is just Ugh. dirty and jacky. Jacky. Yeah, jacky. This movie's out of print. I have it on DVD in the collection. I want to pick it up, and it is 28 weeks later. So I had to grab that one. For the collection. Look at these. These ones but. match. They kind of have a little, uh. Yeah. I know. Hollow foil. Hollow foil. So I Hello picked foil. That, I picked that one up. Next one, another Mel Gibson movie. I have this movie on DVD in the collection. I've never seen it to this day, but I'm going to watch it now because I have it on Blu ray. I haven't seen it either. And it is Mel Gibson's uh, We Were Soldiers. Fun fact when I post on Instagram, I usually say rewatch. If yeah. I don't say rewatch, it means I haven't seen it. Yep. Usually. I, I do the same thing. I say watch or rewatch. <laughs> um, this movie, I have the first movie. I have the third movie. And I don't have the second or the fourth. I heard that there's a fourth movie. so I, gotta, I did not know that there's a fourth. I got to look for it at Bull Moose. Oh, I think it's boy. DVD only. That's okay. Right. I'll take it. But now I have at least the first three for Marie. And it is God's Not Dead. So, I want to check these out. Yeah. I'm curious. So now Marie has a trilogy. She can check all those out. That's everything I got from Clutter Finds. Clutter Finds. Next it. one is a bunch of other titles. Most of these are upgrades as well. Look at them. They're all naked. Yep. But <laughs> I don't know who that one came from. There's no uh, tag in it. Just hide them but, to the side. Right? Yep. This, I have it in the collection on DVD. I want to upgrade it says uh dylan mcdermott uh john corbett and Kristen stewart in the messengers i know a lot of people don't like this movie i enjoy it so that's why i wanted to upgrade it for mm -hmm. the collection i don't remember it if i saw it this movie is uh scream factory i have it on dvd in the collection <gasps> marie likes this movie i like this movie i wanted to upgrade it to the collector's edition and it is village of the damned it's a creepy village for sure yeah, but i really enjoy this film I have the original as well. Show the children. Yeah. I have the original as well. As, Very creepy. As well as uh, that one now. That uh, village is damned. Yeah. I have this movie on DVD with the slip cover. I want to upgrade it to Blu-ray. A lot of people don't like with this movie. With the slip cover. Yeah, with the slip cover. A lot of people don't like this movie, but I enjoy it. So I want to upgrade it. And it is Dracula Untold. Dracula. With the slip. I like pretty much almost all the Dracula movies. But I really enjoyed this one. I've I like watched it a couple of times, so I wanted to pick that one up. I don't know if I've seen this one. I think for I the collection. This movie. Yeah, I just watched it on DVD not too long ago. Yes. Damn you. Uh, this. Then movie, you upgrade them. This movie I have it on DVD with the lenticular slip, and I upgraded to the Blu-ray with the lenticular slip. 
I like this movie. It's a Rob Zombie film. And it is Lords of Salem. The lenticulars are the same, so I would just get rid of the DVD lenticular. I don't know if I can. But I guess we got to keep them both. Yeah, this is a good film. I enjoy it. It's creepy. It was filmed in Salem, Mass. But mm. I really enjoy it. So I had to pick that one up for the collection. Wow. This movie, I have it on DVD in the collection. I have the second one on Blu-ray, so I wanted to have them both on Blu-ray so they could be side-by-side -side in the collection. And it is The Last Exorcism. But I enjoy this film. It's pretty creepy. Freaks me out. Reminds me a lot of... The first exorcism? No. I forgot what it reminds me of. I, I drew a blank when Marie opened up her yapper. But it freaked me out. I wish they always did that. For, for uh, the DVD and the Blu-ray or 4K and Blu-ray. What? Artwork. No artwork. Yeah. No work. Most no people work. like artwork, artwork. Oh my God, I forgot that. I forgot the piece of paper. Uh, next one is a movie I have on DVD in the collection. This movie freaks me out. And I really enjoy it. It has Mila Jovovich in it. And it is The Fourth Kind on Blu-ray. Mm. I really enjoy this film. It is creepy as hell. If you've never seen it, I say highly, highly check it out. I really, really enjoy that movie. Yeah, with the other 400. And this movie is another... Screen Factory Collector's Edition. I don't have this one. I wanted it. It's an anthology film. And it's a John Carpenter anthology film. And it is Body Bags. Oh boy. I've had this in my Amazon cart for longer than I've known uh, Marie for. I was going to say, I think it's been in there since I met. Yeah. And I've never pulled the trigger. You know, the slip went out of print, and then it really sat in my cart. And now I can finally delete it out of my cart. I'm but, like, oh, I want to buy you this. She's like, I don't need anything. Yeah, okay. but that is everything that I got for this video. Pretty much all Blu-rays on this one. And I am happy to have a bunch of upgrades. Boy. But here we go. Look at all that blue. But pretty much a lot of upgrades, mostly for the collection. A lot of these movies I have, most of them, some of them I don't, but pretty much everything. You need it. You want it. Uh, no. Pre pretty much everything except for God's Not Dead, I've seen before, and We Were Soldiers are the only two I've never seen. Body bags. Oh. Yeah. I've seen body bags before. Oh, you see. I saw it on VHS. But. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you didn't like it, videos before and after. If you want to subscribe to the subscription button, hit the notification bell. We'll have more videos for you. If you want to leave a comment down below about any of the stuff that we showed, start typing away. But until next time, guys. Uh, bye. And a happy new year, too. Yeah, filthy animals.